Hey guys, we're talking morning routines, one of my favorite topics, one of Grandmaster's favorite topics. Um, this is big in like um, just any any sort of uh, personal development stuff you could get into. Like for a while I was listening to Tim Ferriss, if you guys know who he is, and he's ask every single guest, he's you know interviewing successful people and asking them about their morning routines. Um, I think it's great because it's like putting on your armor for the day. Uh, if you do it really well, you should be able to lock in a winning day. Uh, right in the beginning of your day, to make sure that you have done the things that are going to move you toward toward your goals and where you want to be. Um, so I want to share my uh, morning routine with you. And along the way, you know, we'll talk about some of the concepts perhaps that sort of inform my decision making on this. And I'm not saying that, that like my thing's the best. Certainly would like to hear what you guys know about this and how you implement your morning routine strategy. All right, so here's what I do. Um, first, I wake up and I've got a prayer, Bible, journal uh, time, and I try to do this before I even leave uh, my bed. And the reason I have this, uh, there are a few reasons I have this first one. One of the reasons is it's the thing that I'm most likely to mess up and need a lot of discipline for. And so I, if, if I get out of bed and my mind starts going on like all the things I have to do that day, I, oh boy, I just know there's a pretty good chance I'm not going to make it back to this. So to get a mindset of gratitude uh, going and, and just to focus on the you know permanent things and things that are the most important, um, that happens first. Then I drain this water because it's healthy. And I put on these workout clothes. And I make a quick stop in the old... Uh, bathroom here for a morning toilette to do especially teeth uh, brushing important first thing otherwise feels kind of gross all right then you go out I go out here and my next step is to train so I like to strength train uh, four times a week I like nice uh, weightlifting stuff that's one of the few things that I actually don't feel bad <laughs> spending money on so um, so I come out here, I train, um, lifting four days a week, conditioning two days a week. Um, you know, the karate is is like a, a different a different topic. Like you might wonder, hey, you're a karate guy, what, what does your karate fit in? That that kind of happens in a in a different way. We're, I'm talking about my morning workout, lifting four, conditioning two, one day off on my um, on my off day, I'd probably still come out here and do some stretching. Okay, uh, then done with physical training. So then I would grab, I would come inside and I would make a uh, nice protein shake uh, for myself. Got uh, up here, and oh, there it is, trying to look at the camera while I do that. Uh, I like a good protein shake. Um, mix that up. I uh, have it right in here. I probably have a little podcast playing while I'm doing that. Uh, and then uh, I like to grind up uh, some coffee. Prefer a little French press, uh, as long as I'm just doing it for myself. So I, I do that. Um, again, podcast going, supplements, coffee's ready. Uh, I take my coffee, I come over, and I'm going to grab up whatever book I happen to be reading. I'm not big on multiple books going at the same time. Uh, if I got something really dense, I might have... Um, a different thing like for later in the day uh, just that that isn't uh, that doesn't require so much discipline but like I've got some discipline reading to do like right now I'm really enjoying this uh, uh, middle March um, usually I'm like uh, classic lit history you know sociology stuff and I kind of like kind of like rotate through those uh, topics but but once in a while there's something that takes a lot of discipline so it's important to me that that goes in the morning routine if there's any sort of a slog involved. So uh, I'll read that with my coffee and then just kind of get into my day. And, and you know, what I really like about this is that if you've got those key personal development things knocked out early, you can just, you can just really devote the rest of your day to uh, serving other people, to doing a good job in your job. Um, and like, I feel like if I didn't do those things early, uh, like it would be bugging me all day. It would, it would be, it would be harder to focus on really giving where you're supposed to give if you haven't done the work to fill yourself up, uh, you know, first thing. And that might sound selfish, but I think it's really not. I think it's, 
Um, the way that you honor uh, your job and the people in your life is by taking really, really good care of your, yourself so that, so that you got, you got something uh, to give. So, um, yes, we want to hear about your morning routine. Awesome topic. Talk to you later.